Hi, my name is Nick, and this tooltip is on BIM files. BIM files give you the ability to import and export elements and library items. These items can be shared with others so that everyone is using the same information. Let's first take a look at how you can export items out to create a BIM file. We're going to go to File, Export, and then we're going to select Catalog to BIM. This will bring up the Export Items to a BIM File dialog box. On the left hand side of the dialog box is the currently opened catalog. If we expand the element tree we can see all of the different elements that are going to be a part of that catalog. And inside of this we're going to see each individual folder. We can select an actual folder and hit the transfer button to transfer all of the contents within that folder over. We can also get even further refined and say, well, I only want certain elements to come out of this folder. So I only want the counter depth fridge. I can then select that element, select the transfer button, and on the right hand side under elements, we can now see that the appliances elements tree has been brought over. And within that, we're seeing just the counter depth fridge. Anything that has to do with the materials, the line color, the pattern will also be brought over automatically and those are going to be your library elements. Once you've transferred all of your elements over that you want to save, you simply say OK. This will then ask you to save this to a directory. We're going to save this to the desktop and I'm just going to call it Bridge and we're going to say Save. That new BIM file is now stored on your computer and you can now send this to anyone that needs to use that same refrigerator. Underneath the file export option there is also a project to BIM and this one differs in the fact that this is only going to take into consideration what is imported into the current drawing. So if you have specific elements that are in the actual file those will be visible for you and you'll be able to add those in um, and create a BIM file from what's within the project itself. Next we're going to look at importing a BIM file. So if I go to File, Import, I can select the BIM to Catalog option. And from here I can go in and select a specific file that I want to save to my catalog. And in here I'm going to go in and I'm going to select the fridge BIM that we just exported out and I'm going to say Open. So now what we're going to see is on the right hand side we're going to see the elements at that are in that particular BIM file and there's that counter depth fridge and if you notice the transfer button is now pointing in the opposite direction. So this is telling us that we're taking information from this BIM file and we're transferring it to our master catalog. When you hit the transfer option it will bring that counter depth fridge over to be added into the master catalog. We're going to say cancel on that. We also regularly add new BIM files for download on our website, which you can then download for free. So if you go up to our website, we actually have a section called BIM catalogs. And in here, you can go through and browse all the different elements that we have created and stored as BIM files for you to download. And then all you have to simply do is select the download button and you'll be able to download that specific file. And it will always save to your downloads folder and you'll be able to then import that using the import BIM file that we just mentioned. We hope this tooltip helps you moving forward. If you like what we're creating, be sure to subscribe for future videos. If you have comments, please let us know below. Thank you.